I am getting ready. Today it is a work from home day. I don't usually do makeup on work from home days when I'm literally just staying at home. But today I want to go to a cafe and then also after work I have some plans. So I thought might as well just do my makeup now. I have stand up in a couple of minutes. They moved our afternoon stand ups to now the mornings. So I'm gonna hop onto that. I'm currently working on my first independent project since starting this internship. I have a lot of ownership over it, which is exciting, but also scary since I'm the one responsible for defining it, driving it, and executing it. Essentially, the project goal is to build ownership over monitoring our Splunk dashboard logs, affectionately called the Anger Index. I have defined requirements to include creating an automated daily report showcasing deltas, i.e. how errors have changed from one day to the next. I'm currently exploring Splunk to better understand the dashboard's behind-the-scenes queries and how I can manipulate them to get the deltas. That is a wrap on my stand-up. It was super chill. It was like 15 minutes. And I have the rest of the day with no meetings. Yay! That is something I really like about my team. I have a lot less meetings than I previously did when I worked in more PM roles. I do have friends who are also in software engineering and they have a lot more meetings than me, so maybe I just lucked out. made my breakfast i made my oatmeal i am so excited to eat this it looks so good i also made just some toast with cream cheese and some scrambled eggs currently i'm working on the exploration process of better understanding splunk it's a lot of trial and error and scouring the internet for articles and a whole lot of confusion. That's the thing with working on a broader project. It can be hard to measure progress tangibly from one day or one hour to the next. And so it can be hard to stay motivated and accountable. I finally made some progress, which I am so pumped about. I got some of my queries working and they produced the results I was looking for. So I just need to start formatting and just tailoring a few other things, but it is heading on the right track. So to celebrate, I thought that I might spend the rest of my workday at a cute cafe. I just got dressed to leave the house. This is the fit and let's go pack up and head out. I went through a phase of really disliking working from home. I felt so unmotivated, but recently I've actually been really enjoying it. I also enjoy changing up my environment every so often, so I'm thankful I live in an area where there are lots of nice cafes within walking distance. staying at the cafe for very long because I got hungry. I did not have my second meal today yet. Um, so I made myself a little BLT sandwich 
with avocado. I'm so excited. I'm not going to show you the the airplane view. Is that what it's called? I'm not going to show you it because it looks so messy and unesthetic. But it looks so good and I'm so hungry. Cheers. Mm. I also have my drink from the cafe because I am a very slow drinker. I've seen those TikToks where it's like, are you like a drinker or a sipper? I'm definitely a sipper. I just like to enjoy my drinks. I can drink water like in gulps, but when it comes to my expensive cafe drinks, like I just wanna enjoy it and take my time, you know? Let me know if you're also a sipper. I'm going to devour this and also just finish off the work day. My friend Jess recently got a climbing membership, so I decided to join her. I really enjoyed trying new sports, and this was my first time in a long time and my second overall time climbing. It was definitely very tough. I didn't know how to leverage my strength, I didn't trust my grip, and I was terrified to jump. Regardless, it was still a lot of fun and a very exhilarating and satisfying experience to be able to complete a climb. Right hand. There you go. That's the end hold. Yay! I'm scared of heights. Nice! Okay. Oh, oh she did it! Oh, what the f***? No, it's not hot. <laughs> Okay, it is 10.30 p.m. and I am finally back home and going to eat my dinner. <laughs> this is unfortunately not that uncommon for me to eat my dinner super late. I am super excited to eat this. I made pasta and with meatballs. Not in our Smith level pasta. Pasta was, I just put them in the pan and boiled it and the meatballs were already formed and seasoned for me. I just put it on the pan fry and then I literally assemble. I don't think I technically cook, I just assemble things, but it counts, right? <laughs> okay, cheers. Mm, this is good. I should take a picture of this. Take a picture of my own food. Send it to my parents. I finished up the rest of my evening by eating my very late dinner, taking a shower, uploading my content from today, and starting some work on my thumbnail, as well as a bit of reading. If you guys made it to the end of my last video, I am happy to update you that I have finished my last book and I am on to the next one. So this is me literally just starting Michelle Obama's The Light We Carry. I read her first book, Becoming, and enjoyed it. And we made it to the end of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.